Hello and welcome to Watch Mojo UK's Weekly Lowdown, a super serious UK news show about some things you care about and some things you probably don't. So, first off... Yes, our epic ice fall by someone called Gemma Collins Award of the Week goes to Gemma Collins for that face plant you just saw. We shouldn't laugh, should we? She did bruise her legs quite badly. We certainly shouldn't be sharing memes like this. Or like this. I mean, it's just totally inappropriate behaviour. She was brave to get up from it. As brave as heavyweight fighter Tyson Fury, actually. Her words, not mine. But you're boring! Now, last week, we released the first of a new series called How To British, with the first video focusing on going to the cinema. Things like sneaking sweets in your jacket and generally how to survive in a room full of strangers. And thanks to all of those who liked and commented on the video, many of you actually suggested some new titles. How To British At The Pub, In The Office, On A Bus, How To British Banter Edition. Anyway, we'd love to hear more from you guys on this, so if you've got any other how to British ideas, just leave them in the comments below. Stop talking about American things and let's watch the best film ever made. Now, the B word has been in the news again. The Brexit. 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 Obviously. Uh, with constant talk over how it's going to affect trade and, more importantly, the things that are on our supermarket shelves, i.e. there won't be any and whatever is on the shelves will be more expensive. So we thought it'd be fun to ask you guys in our YouTube community tab which food product you would like to see disappear from supermarket shelves for good. I mean, we might as well make the most of Brexit. Whoa, nearly said it then. Some food items mentioned included custard creams, vegan and gluten things, orange marmalade, coconut themed stuff, themed? For me, it'll be malt loaf. I just don't get it, never have. It's all me nan used to have in for some reason. Oh, do you want some wet fruit bread? No, I'm 12. Eat. The food. The food. Here's a weird story. So Olivia Coleman, the brilliantly talented actress who, fingers crossed, will be nabbing herself an Oscar for her performance in The Favourite, we have mentioned it a few times, revealed this week how she'd had to wrestle with Wikipedia to change her own wiki page, because apparently she got a date of birth wrong, putting her age at 55. She's actually 44. She even contacted Wikipedia, pretending to be someone else, as to not sound vain, claiming that the date of birth on the page was wrong. They ignored it, until she said, hey, it's actually me, Olivia Coleman. please change it. To which they said, can you prove it with a birth certificate? Anyway, it's changed now. At least I didn't get her name wrong. Imagine that at the awards do. And the Oscar goes to Ollie Goldman. If you thought that story was odd, listen to this. Now, boy band Blue, yes, the guys who brought you one love and two close, are set to start in a string of new adverts for... Wait for it. Hull-based heating company Ideal Boilers. I promise you, this is not a joke. Their songs will be appearing in TV adverts for the company, adverts which have been described as quirky. I wonder if they'll have the lyrics changed to match the subject matter. Don't let your heating bills all rise. No doubt they'll be getting a tasty sum of money for it. And fair dues, the lads have had quite a hard time, what with their own management suing them. I'm trying to think of boiler-based pop songs now. Hit my boiler one more time. Combi Chameleon. In other news, a woman gets Harry Styles' face tattooed on her face to get his attention. What? A guy in Manchester skis to work following airport closing snowfall. And Beth Tweddle sues the makers of Channel 4's The Jump following her fractured vertebrae back in 2016. For context, please see our list of top 10 British TV shows that need to die. See you next week. Check out these other great clips from Watch Mojo UK and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.